This is not the message I ever wanted to deliver. Like you, I watched the news of the unspeakable events at Sandy Hook Elementary School, stunned and saddened. Like you, I cried when I learned how many of our colleagues and how many young children had been gunned down by a senseless killer. And like you, I felt the pain and grief for the parents, the other children, the educators, and the whole community, all who lost so much that they held so dear. How does one move on from that? Newtown, Connecticut is now everyone's town, and Sandy Hook Elementary, its students, staff, and community is now in our hearts and prayers. The educators of Sandy Hook are represented by the AFT, and the NEA has been working with AFT to do whatever we can to help Sandy Hook educators find a way to comfort and somehow to healing. From past crises, we know that each person has a different path to healing. The NEA Health Information Network has an online crisis guide, a guide that gives step-by-step -step information about what to expect and actions to take after a crisis. It has tips for parents, teachers, and other adults. You can find the guide at neahin.org. But isn't it sad that we now know so much about heart-rending crises? Today, as we offer our hearts and try to console, I hope we all feel a new urgency. We cannot allow the violence to go on. We cannot turn away and think, well, that's just the way it is. To those who say nothing can be done, I say, I don't believe it. We can do something to better protect our children and to better strengthen our communities. We can and must find a better way to live in this country. I agree with President Obama that it is time for us to, quote, come together and take meaningful action to prevent more tragedies like this, regardless of the politics. For me, that means looking at our culture, our support services, and certainly the availability of assault weapons. The conversation cannot wait. We cannot risk one more child's life. We have all cried over the brave educators and children of Sandy Hook. As we look up from our tears, let's join together to do something to stop this from ever happening again. Let's find a new purpose from tragedy, a new resolve to act. The NEA family is strong because we have each other. For the new year, I wish you and your loved ones strength, health, and happiness.